Let's look at the laptop. Warren is blowing up my inbox now. <laughs> as long as he helps me figure this out. Hey, Max. The doctor is in the house. I love his little picture. <laughs> I've been thinking long and hard about your weird request. I just sent you a bunch of physics and science links, and without further ado, here's a few time travel films you must see. I'll send more as they come to mind. The doctor expects a full explanation for your newfound chrono interest. The Time Machine, the 1960 version, fun early steampunk sci-fi, and Murlocs faces melt. Primer, Lo-Fi, lo Time Travelers, and Dallas Brillant, I'll explain to you after you watch it. Time after time, H.G. Wells used his time machine to chase Jack the Ripper to modern day San Francisco. Super cool and clever. Pulp Fiction, serious. The switching between timelines gives a good basic out line to relatively plus Uma somewhere in time big cult around this romantic sci-fi written by Richard Matheson the best kind of chick flick you'll cry like baby I did <laughs> time slip you can borrow my copy of this awesome Japanese flick or we can watch it together Sonny Chiba and his soldiers end up back in samurai days Bas basically tanks versus ninjas <laughs> time cop Jean Claude Van Dame does the splits on a kitchen counter in his underwear. <laughs> Need I say more? <laughs> That's all the time I have now, as I have actual quantum physics to plow through, and not your fun Back to the Future homework that I never get. <laughs> now that you've discovered the art of science, I expect to see you in the lab more as well. I could always use a new partner in time. Get it? Don't hit. I'm leaving. Doctor Who? This is so insane. It sounds logical to me. <laughs> Hold on. So I can better read. Join the chrononauts. Time travel is not just a science fiction. History has recorded numerous cases of individuals who have managed to bend all rules of the time-space continuum. The present dilemma is that those who can navigate temporal dimensions are rightly reluctant to reveal themselves due to the impact of public and government scrutiny. Nations around the world have spent literally billions of dollars trying to build and top secret their own version of a time machine. Thankfully, this is not a case where infinite revenue equals control of the infinite. Or you might not be reading this website at all. This is the, where the chronauts enter the picture. It's clear based on the vast scientific information that time travel is only applicable on a person by person basis, not driven nor dominated by any one particular physics or thermodynamics calibration. Whew. For this reason, we have created a forum where past, present, and future time travelers can share tips, ideas, and experience to guide those navigating the rocky seas of time. Hence, our moniker, the Chrononauts Brave Solitary Adventures on an Infinite Voyage. Register within the forum and step into a river of time without fear of being swept away. Holy shit. This wormhole thing makes total sense, but doesn't explain how I can do what no scientist ever has. Uh, wormhole. Welcome to the wonderful world of the wormhole, a term lazily overexploited in science and science fiction. For nymphites, visualize a wormhole like an invisible tunnel from one end of space to another. Thus, if wormholes exist, time travel is possible and probable. The human trick is to discover the means or device needed to link and traverse both ends of this time tunnel. Einstein's theory of relativity poses that this is within the realm of theory, while a new generation of physicists hope to develop an actual working model of this fascinating space-time conundrum. Inside a wormhole are links and articles relating to the most recent developments of this fluid theory. I feel like my brain is melting. I would <laughs> say this is some crazy shit, but now I'm not so certain. Should I sign? Um, why are quantum physicists trying to control time? As you read these words, physicists and scientists around the world are using taxpayer-funded government programs to shatter our notions of time and space, potentially altering the course of history itself. For example, Australian researchers are using photons to simulate quantum 
particles as they travel through time itself. Even though quantum time mechanics is a very recent theory, first predicted in 1991, it has caught fire within the scientific community who eliminated ethics and morality from their dangerous experiment. Holy shit. I, I feel like either my brain or I'm, I'm either going to get smarter from all this information or my brain is just going to leak and out I my ears. I was into Halloween. Dana is not messing around here. Ghoul Days Halloween Party. Bring it, Blackwell Bloodsuckers. Next to prom night and big football, my favorite time of year is the annual Ghoul Days Black Hell Halloween Pate. Picture me busting a thriller zombie move. <laughs> Principal Wills has given us almost carte blanche, because I can't pronounce shit, to decorate the halls and gym within taste and safety, so I want every student to be scared shitless when they walk to the classes. I know you all have tons of homework, as I do, but let's make this a Halloween that Blackwell will never forget. The decoration committee meets in the gym at 3.30 next Wednesday... October 10th, this gives you plenty of time to not have any excuses for flaking, and if you don't show up to help haunt the halls, the boogeyman will get you. Let's show Blackwell our ghoul power. Pleasant screams, Dana of the Dead. <laughs> oh, Dana. Ah. Alright. Okay, um... Alright, I think I did everything. Hold on, what does that say? Keep calm and carry on. Okay. Shower supplies. Let's take those. Okay, Max. Let's hit the showers now. Now it's time to hit the showers. <laughs> Do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this So time. it's completely normal to walk oh. around... Jeez. One quick rewind and I could stop this TP attack. Well, I don't I don't think You okay, Alyssa? Immature assholes. Sorry, Max. I'm not feeling social right now. Well, at least it wasn't a football. Do I really need you know what? You okay, Alyssa? Immature Okay, hold on. Woo! Warren, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Woo! Whoa! Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. No problem. Let's not be too obvious, you know. Effects. Why, hello again, Alyssa. Damn, that was quick thinking, Max. I'm glad my psychic skills saved you from that toilet paper beatdown. Black <laughs> has a surplus of assholes. Yes. Oh, by the way, Warren said you borrowed his epic film flash drive. I didn't yeah. know you were a sci-fi geek like us. What's your favorite? Doctor Who. Um, Groundhog I Day. I love the idea of going back in time to fix mistakes in Groundhog Day. <laughs> oh, boy. I barely want to go forward in time, much less go backward. <laughs> but it's all about the choices you make now. You and yeah. Warren do know your sci-fi. Be careful, you might make Brooke jealous. I'll just Brooke pretend have I have no idea what you mean. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Showers. Uh, be fun. Thanks for the warning. Yeah, nothing has really changed. Should I go and talk to these people? I'm glad I pissed them off. Woo! Go Dana! <laughs> Having fun? Oh. Hi, Amy. How are you? Much better Power. than yesterday. I'm glad we talked. Yeah. Me too. Me too. I know it's good to just talk about this stuff. Yeah. You're almost psychic. I felt like you knew everything anyway. By the way, eh. the best and biggest news oh. of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. That's oh, awesome, nice. Dana. At least yeah. we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. 
Oh, borrow really? one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. <laughs> uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. Oh, come on. So, are you coming to the party or not? Um, why not? Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. To my room. <laughs> That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a raid. Um, it does sound like fun. Now I have to go contemplate my party future. Yep. Oh, look, contraceptive. Cool. Cool. Hmm. Hey, she plans on having some fun. Speaking of Halloween, look at all this makeup. At least Dana knows how to use it. Yep. I would be kind of, uh... Stuff. Oh my gosh, look at all the Halloween stuff. That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. Oh, come on. Like, you don't enjoy Halloween? Hey, guys. Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? No. Why should I? Because it's fucking hilarious. F -bomb? Church girl gone wild. Kate's not like that and you know it. Really? Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Touche. Seriously. Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. No problem. Uh, what about Zachary? What about Zachary? Did you let him off the hook? When he acts like a worm, I let him dangle. <laughs> I'm glad to see you're back in action. You have a oh, good yeah. heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. Thank That's you. The spirit. Thanks, Juliet. Sure. Talk to you later. No problem. Brooke? Let's hey, talk Brooke. to you. Oh, what's up? Hi, Max. What's up? You look distracted. You look distracted. Everything cool? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. Ugh. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. <laughs> um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Yeah. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Oh, Did wow. you talk to him yet? Uh... No. No, not at all. He's my friend, not my mother. <laughs> And Warren really loves to talk meteorology with me, since I'm one of the few who can talk back. Yeah, talk that's to you good. later, Max. Yep. Yeah. Taylor? Get a life and move on, bitch. Um, should I knock on these guys' doors? Um, hold on, who's- I'm trying to remember who's Stella. Who is Stella? I can't remember who's Stella. Um, I think she... Is she the... Is she the... Oh god, I'm trying to... Is she the really hard thinker? Like, she's working really hard at school? And, you know what I just realized? Red Rum is murder. Backwards. I... <laughs> Should I bother? I'm not so sure. Juliet's room. Juliet is not in there, thank you very much. Uh, can't go in there. Um, Kate's. Ah, <sighs> what is wrong with these guys? Can I? I sure this would just... like to catch this hall tagger. Hold on. See how she is. Hi, Kate! Kate is an early bird. She might be up and gone. That's true. She might. Victoria sounds like she's partying. Party hardy. Brooke's room, she's not in there. Let's just take a shower. Because I'd rather not. Oh, shower time. Shower time. Showers. We're not going to be watching ourselves shower, are we? Oh, there's Kate. Kate! 